These are rappers who fell off. Number one, CJ. There are many New York rappers who've managed to make it big, but others just can't seem to maintain their success. One such rapper is CJ, best known for his smash hit Whoopty. However, since the success of the track in early 2021, CJ has been relatively silent in the music scene. His follow-up single, Bop, failed to make the same impact as Whoopty, and his debut album Loyalty Over Royalty received mixed reviews from critics. This, along with a lack of consistent releases, has led to a decline in CJ's popularity and success in the rap game. It remains to be seen if he will be able to bounce back and reclaim his spot as one of New York's rising rappers. So far though, he's undoubtedly fallen off the face of the earth. Everyone knew about his one-hit wonder song, but now he's just another rapper who nobody remembers. He's going to have to do better than that if he wants to stay relevant in the rap game. Until then, CJ remains one of the biggest examples of a rapper who fell off quickly. Number 2. Lil Mosey all it takes is saying that musically people would compare you to Drake for everyone to realize just how much you've fallen off. And that's exactly what Lil Mosey said in an interview when asked if he was a mumble rapper. Lil Mosey rose to fame with his summer hit Blueberry Fago, which surpassed 1 billion streams in one year. However, his next release, Falling, failed to gain the same success and his monthly listeners have declined. Despite claiming he doesn't know what mumble rap is, Lil Mosey is noted for his whispery, mumbled lyrics, but he hasn't been able to replicate the success of Drake, who he believes he compares to musically. There's confidence, and then there's delusion, and it seems like Lil Mosey has a Lil bit of both. Not to say that he hasn't had some success, but it definitely seems like it's been a downfall for the Washington rapper. Rather than focus on the music, Lil Mosey has been in the news for other reasons. This has also likely contributed to his fall from the top of the rap game, but who knows. Number 3. J Hood Jay Hood used to be a figure that many fans of the locks looked up to as the next big thing. Unfortunately, his career never took off the way many predicted it would. Jay Hood made a name for himself as a protege of the locks, appearing on multiple mixtapes and album cuts. However, after multiple delays and false starts on his debut album, Jay Hood became frustrated and publicly disrespected his mentors in a YouTube clip. This led to his expulsion from the locks, and he has struggled to gain the same level of success ever since. While he continues to release music, Jay Hood's career has taken a major hit and he has yet to reach the same level of fame and recognition he had while under the wing of the locks. This has solidified him as a rapper who fell off and never quite lived up to his potential. J Hood who? Nobody remembers him now. Number 4. Boo and Gotti My block hot, ain't it, man? It's hard to set up shop here, ain't it, man? You already know that some of those dynamic duos in rap don't always stay together for long. Such is the case with Boo and Gotti. This Chicago duo came onto the scene with an impressive verse on R. Kelly's Fiesta, catching the attention of fans and industry insiders alike. They were signed to R. Kelly's Rockland Records, but their debut album never materialized. They then signed with Cash Money Records, releasing their only album Perfect Timing in 2003. Unfortunately, it received little promotion and failed to make a commercial impact. After being dropped from Cash Money, they were briefly part of Lil Wayne's Young Money, but it didn't lead to much success. Since then, Boo and Gotti have faded into obscurity and are often forgotten in discussions about hip-hop duos. While they were once the cream of the crop as far as rap duos go, nobody remembers them except for a few loyal fans and die-hard hip-hop heads. Their quick rise and fall have solidified them as a perfect example of a duo who fell off the face of the earth. From Lil Mosey, who compared himself to Drake for musical comparisons, to CJ of Hoopty fame, these rappers show how quickly one can fall off. But it's not just about one-hit wonders, as even established rappers like Boo and Gotti and Jay Hood also experienced a decline in their careers. It's time for these rappers to just admit they've fallen off.